And hello everybody, welcome to a different type of game. You can hear some type of birds in the background. I took the liberty of turning the music down on this, so it isn't so loud or out of the way. This game is called Leaving Lindo. Um, it's a walking simulator game created by E-Shade, and I want to go ahead and play this for a little bit, and we'll see what you guys think of it. Interesting. Alright, so we can move around with the A and D, use a mouse for spinnies. Okay, can we interact with this jug maybe? Nice picture. <laughs> nice picture on the wall. The bed, everything. It all looks pretty cool. It looks nice. You know, this is different. It's definitely different. But uh, that right there looks like it would make a nice good screenshot for a uh, thumbnail. So we're going to go ahead and get that. And we'll see what else we can get for a uh, thumbnail today as well. Um, Alright. Alright, so our name is Clara. Congratulations on your acceptance into the Guild of Scientific Exploration. You have been appointed Junior Marine Researcher aboard a pioneering expedition into the Northern Seas. We have arranged for your crewmates to collect you at the port of Lindo. Please ensure that you have the following materials prepared prior to your departure. A sparse shape, or uh, a spare ship uniform. All right, this other stuff we must already have and great voyages. All eyes on the horizon. Okay, so we have to find... Ah, there's something over here. What is it? I need to pack a few more items. Okay. What is that? Standard issue guild uniform. Okay. I'd better pack this. Okay, so we gotta put this in the uh, case. Alright, so what else do we need? Can we take the book with us? That's a good question. Can we take the book with us? Uh, space. Alright, did we put that in here? Okay, we got another note. What is this one? There once was a girl who stood at the sea and took notes on fancy summons. She studied the water and chased down the other the otters. The girl researched many neat things. One day the girl will set sail out on her own in a big wooden ship that she calls her home. She'll go to new lands and sleep in the sands while she researches many neat things. Sorry for the new <laughs> terrible this pond this poem is, but I think it suits you. Love. Jacob. I wish he could come with me on an expedition with me, but it meant too much to me. Okay. So... Well, that's fine. Every single time I walk by here... Alright, so we picked up this... Oh! Nice. Well, it would be nice. There you go. All right. So if we step back a little bit, there you go. Okay. So it's telling us we needed something else. What is this? I'm going to miss my little cousin Toma. He is so sweet. I so said his little cut. Her, her little cousin Toma is the one that built it. I need to pack a few more items. Alright, so what else do we need? I mean, we put the Sperry ship uniform in there. Standard marine research kit, a rucksack for shape, oil boots. Okay. Can we open the door? That's a good question. Ooh. Okay, so we can't. Alright, zoom is for this.
Okay, I'm pressing the middle key. Nothing. Ah, definitely interesting. Nothing of interest around here, but still, it's a nice home. Looks interesting. How would you like to build something like this in Ryzen World? Ooh, yeah, give me a picture of that bed. Alright, um... Is there a staircase here? Yes, yeah. oh, there's a ladder. This place is nice. I can't stop but want to take screenshots of everything. I mean, this just looks gorgeous. Nice game. Nice game. I mean, that might be my opinion, but still. I'm writing a, a final time to express my resentment of this decision, Clara. Is still of this decision. Clara is still a child. Why are we letting her choose a path that might destroy both her and our family? Have you really considered the risk of this expedition? Are you ever c even concerned for the safety of your own daughter? Stop her from doing this before it's too late. Concerned, your brother. Well, you were so very much welcome. <gasps> It's got to spin. I might not ever. F oh. Oh. Wow. Yeah, that is a nice view. Really nice view. Yes, it is. All right. Anything else over here? We got that piece. All right. Uh, there appears to be something right here. What is this? Great voyages, the seas of the north are widely unexplored. Researchers predict these waters are expensive and small. Expeditions have revealed numerous islands filled with diverse life and communities. Due to the unpredictable and violent nature of these waters, many exploration ships have been lost while attempting to form new contacts and carry out scientific research. I'm going to need this. Oh, okay. Nice. Are we going to need anything else down here? I'm sure there has to be some other things. Nice picture, by the way. Alright. What's this? I wonder if Dad would be proud of me. Well, you know what? It's never about your parents. It's always about you. Once you grow up and you leave the nest, your life is your own. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. That looks gorgeous out there. That really, that does. Look at that water trickle. Oh, my. Wow. Should we? Should we? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> Aha! We got another thing. Shady and post. Lindon rebuilds. Mudslide devastates buildings but not spirits. Just four months into reconstruction and the town of Lindo shines with the hope of becoming a modern city. After the port town was utterly destroyed in a mudslide, many citizens of Lindo relocated to Nava, seeking a quick recovery in an established locale. Despite this, some dedicated Linzonians were reluctant to give up on their community and have instead devoted themselves to re-establishing the town of Lindo on drier, safer ground. With a brand new port in operation, trade has resumed and Lindo is well on its way to recovery. Nice. Oh, hello, I didn't even see you over there. And who are you, young lady? Or should we say, I guess that you know what, that could be her mother. That really could be her mother. Amatue. 
Good morning, dear. I made you this basket of treats to take on your trip. This won't last long. They won't last long, but I hope you remind you of home. Why, thank you so very much, Mother. Oh, and I remembered how sick you got on those canoes. I can only imagine what you'll be like on your expedition. Okay. Let's get a picture of Mother. I know we have bottles of seasickness reliever around here somewhere. Your father always needed it too. Would you go check in the attic? I don't want you to be sick all over your new friends. I'll take a look. You have to find that damn attic ro pull rod. Of course. <laughs> so that is so cool. Oh, so this is her mother. Her mom is cooking supper. Aww. You're getting ready to leave your mother behind. That poor old woman. She's going to be so sad. Okay. What all do we got around here? All right. So we need to find an attic pull rod. What's it? What's this over here? The first of his class and the first to cross the Navin Sea. Nice. Okay, so that's a boat. I should get that medicine in the attic first. Okay, 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 okay. Let's head up. Okay, so we gotta find the attic pull rod. This is very nice. Very well scripted, very well done. Okay, so how do we get up there? If that's the attic... Then... How do we get up there? What was that? Okay, um, we need an attic pull rod. Let's go ahead and let's... I'll get by with what only I've ha I put in this trunk. Makes me wonder why what I... All packed. No, we're not all packed. We need the medicine. We need to find the attic pull rod. Where do you think you're going? Naughty girl. You gotta go upstairs. We gotta find a way up there. Aha! Eh! Okay. So, where's the attic pull rod at? Alright, let's go have a look around downstairs. Yeah, I think it might be down here. Can we run? Aha! Here's the attic pull rod. Got it. All right, let's go up to the attic. All right, let's go in Mother's bedroom. And let's open that up. Oh, boy. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Wow. I haven't seen one of these things since I was a kid. Oh, my goodness. Wow. <laughs> that creeped me out. <laughs> Yeah, one of my old addicts when I was a kid was inside one of these, uh... A mixture of ginger and peppermint. Works well enough. Cool! I hope I, de I, hope I develop sea legs, but this will have to do in the meantime. Alright, let's go downstairs and talk to Mother. Let's take have one more look up around here. Nothing else? Okay. Alright, can we put this attic back to up? Can we push this thing now? We're just gonna leave this? Oh my goodness. Wow, well, I have not seen an attic door like that in a long time. It just seems kind of rude to leave it sitting like that. Alright, let's go meet up with Mother. 
Goodbye, mother. Akri. You have a busy day ahead of you. Go enjoy yourself. I'll meet you at the Lindo docks this afternoon. Aww. Goodbye, mother. Goodbye. Aww. Visit Uncle's farm. Walk in the forest. Let's go visit Uncle's farm. Change isn't always easy. No, it's not. It's actually a part of growing up. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, yes. Alright, guys. I'm going to end this episode. I'm going to keep these things short, sweet, and to the... <gasps> oh, wow. Point. And I'll see you guys next episode. Where we're going to take a look at Uncle's farm besides... Oh, wow. He loves flowers. He loves flowers. Oh... Alright, the train's saying goodbye. I'll see you guys next episode. Later.